Saturday, March 21st. It's time for News Not So Serious. Hi, I'm Blueberry Paul. First, let's start with something unusual. A lady went to a park and saw a goose with something unusual. Gilbert the goose survives a dart through head. Some feathers were ruffled in Georgia when a loose goose was found with a dart in his head. Sunday Spring woman Man Harrison told WSB TV she was at Arlington Memorial Cemetery on Tuesday when she saw injured animal and reported. Though Gilbert was clearly unable to duck out the way of the dart, it would appear the goose is doing swimmingly now. Attacks on geese have become increasingly common over the past few years, official told the station. Just the year, goose was found in a Cobb County, Georgia, with its head pierced with a narrow. Fox Glenn reported. Authorities have not yet found any suspects that fits to be Gilbert's shooting. We can read at Huffington Post. Eurovision finals broadcast in Sweden was quite unique due to one person who was signing for the deaf people. Sweden falls in love with the man who signs for Eurovision hits. Tommy Karen's performance during Saturday broadcast has become social media sensation with demands to send Tommy to Vienna for the finals. As you can see on the video, he does really well. It takes a lot to steal uh, to steal a lime life of uh, at a soccer stadium packed with a screaming pop fans, but Sweden Glitz extravaganza to choose a Eurovision finalist this weekend was an on home death by the charisma of the for of a forty eight old who signed the songs for deaf people and become a viral Sensation! The video was viewed by more than 5 million times on Facebook and YouTube. You probably heard about cheating at schools. It sometimes happens, but in India it gets more extreme than that. These Indian parents climb a school to help their kids cheat on exam. Cheating in school tests in India is an old problem, but malpractice literary scale new heights this week in eastern state of Bihar, when relatives of a 10th grade student climb off the wall of a school building and perch perkinously from the window of a classroom as they handed a cheat sheets to children writing the test. Insights, photographs and videos showing parents, friends and others scaling the school wall Spider-Man style went viral on India on Thursday. Police officers standing nearby watch helplessly. You can read at WashingtonPost.com Now something from Poland at the end. Uh, yesterday took place the sun eclipse. Solar eclipse over Poland. The moon partially covered the sun over Poland at the first day of spring, which was last Friday, in a rare astronomical, astronomical occurrence. The phenomenon is not expected to be repeated until 2026, uh, while the last partial eclipse over Poland was in 2011. Parts of Poland were able to observe an eclipse of up to 76%, but the average will be closer to around 60% ex per se. The eclipse started at 9.39 in the southwest of the country and ended at 12.12 .12 in the northeast, 
expert warn that the looking directly in the sun, even during a partial eclipse, could cause permanent retinal damage. We can read at the news.pl. So that would be all in today's episode. See you next week in another news not so serious.